viewers, my name is Vicente, and another week down, another episode of Titans is Up. Last week's episode left with a cliffhanger with Jason Todd being captured by Deathstroke. Because he was being impulsive, he wanted to prove himself, but he was doing so very recklessly. Not to say that Dick Grayson hasn't been making his own mistakes, he's been a little careless as well, thinking he can do that with the team he has, and not trusting the others and goes in impulsively to try to capture Dr. Light and fails. But thankfully Starlight has slipped out of the grasp of her would-be captor and is on her way back thanks to Raven. So we'll see if she can help out with the trouble that they're all getting themselves into. I can't wait to get into this episode. Cheers! Something different. Do they even know what happened last time? His name is Deathstroke. Old Titan's pissed. Am I the only one that thinks that Aqualad isn't dead? Or is that just hopeful thinking? 22 minutes since abduction. That's awfully specific. Oh, Dr. Light. Did you come up with that shit by yourself? Or did your parents saw you with that bullshit? I mean, come on. What a lame fucking name. Shut it! That's the thing. <laughs> can do it all day. Twice on a Sunday. <laughs> he said shut the fuck up. Well, he's good. Is he good enough though? Damn it. Rachel. Rachel. I wouldn't touch it. I'm up, I'm up. Why'd happened? you want to touch it? Please don't tell Dick. That's his fault. Though it does prove troublesome if he wants to like sleep next to her, knowing that that's lashing out of her. Jason's strong. Be so annoying that Dr. Light will just let him go because he doesn't want to hear him talk. <laughs> we should be out there helping and bring him back. We are helping. No, we're not. Yes, because letting him go would be the best way to shut him up. He was attacked here, then dragged. Tracks disappear 100 yards down. He could be anywhere. If he's still alive. He's alive. Dick? What is it? The motherfucker found it! Why are you sitting there like a damn statue? For a reason you may not be capable of understanding. You're losing focus. This ridiculous costume swinging your sword around, nothing gets done. He gonna kill you. If you're looking for the result, I'm happy to provide you with one. <laughs> it is you they are looking for, but it is he they shall find. Damn. He who? I knew it. Part of me was just to let him go, figuring like, well, if he does some damage, good. I thought I was gonna kill him like a minute ago. They're gonna find him because he's gonna put that tracker in his carcass. And Dr. Light served his purpose. Do you guys have any cereal not made for old people? Hey, I like shredded wheat. I wanted a midnight snack. You can at least try to help. By hanging out with you and your girlfriend in front of a computer? No, no. I'm not having this conversation. I'm sorry Robin 2.0 is missing or whatever. But he did this to himself. Now, if you'll excuse True. me, I'm about to go ham on some cinnamon corn puffs and chill. I agree with her. It's like, you can't do anything about it right now. So just relax. Security alert. Main entrance. Access denied. Is anyone home? Perfect time. I couldn't have said it better myself. Dr. Light. What the fuck? Is that Jason's tracker? I see you found my gift. Deathstroke. Where's Jason? If you want him back. <laughs> Plaza, outside. 
So, what else is up? When my father ripped out my heart, I turned into something different, something I can't control. Well, you couldn't control it before On either. On planet, we have a name for it. It's called transfiguration. People like us are destined to be special, right? I was supposed to destroy worlds. It's a little more complicated at times, but yes. Hey! Look, we can talk and, like, have cookies and milk or something. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> fucking hurt. Okay, fuck this. Hopefully she just knocked her out. Did she seriously injure her? Break her back or something? What the hell? Healing, okay. Oh, that was a bad hit then. Rose deserves better than you for a father. Hey, look at me. I'm not scared of you. You should be terrified, foolish kids. Like lambs to slaughter. Soon you learn. For death leads to purification. We set? Yeah. I'm in position. Anybody got eyes on Dick? God Dick, damn it. We're at the plaza. Where the fuck are you? Dick, what are you doing now? I'm sorry, guys. Dick? Oh my Other god. Things. What was all that about not being able to ask for help? Did he just take that? Run with it. I know you're here. You want your pound of flesh. You can have me. Here I am. But you're not gonna dictate how this will go. And someone else always pays. Let's just get this over with, huh? Oh, this was part of the plan. They figured he'd be listening, and they decoyed the. Has anyone heard from Dick? Where's Dick? Oh my God. Okay. I see the ruse. Say goodbye to your friend. Oh, the old bomb strapped to a hostage. Do you really think you're gonna compliment my hair instead of saying goodbye, Dick Grayson? Oh. Maybe he did lose the others. So what was the plan? Backstep. He's quick. So, what's with the helicopter? Well, hopefully, the others heard all that gunfire. Who's gonna save him? Someone's gonna save him, right? Ah, oh, are you kidding me? He's not dead. It's Jason Todd. I mean, that would be pretty hardcore if they did kill him. But I can't see Jason Todd dying so quickly. I was thinking that, like, at least one of the older crew would be the ones dying off, leaving room for the younger ones to grow and find their own... Uh, I don't know. Well, shit. No, he's not dead. No, he's not dead. You didn't see him hit. You just see him falling and Dick Grayson screaming. But it hasn't gone there yet. I mean, who the fuck is in that helicopter? 
And I did see Donna and them hear the helicopter, so they're probably looking and they can catch him. Who's down there? Donna would be strong enough to, like, jump up and catch him, right? I would think so. Because I didn't see a hawk or dove with their outfits. Though I don't think their wings are good for actual, like, flight as maybe gliding. But, ah, uh, another cliffhanger. Another week I have to wait. Shit. But we also had the death of Dr. Light in this episode. I was pretty sure he was going to kill him. I was pretty sure Deathstroke was going to kill him after he bumped his knee. I was all like, he's about to shoot you right now. And then he didn't right away. And I figured, like, oh, okay, maybe he'll shoot him later. And he did shoot him later, but only, like, a couple seconds later. I figured he'd at least let Dr. Light go and attack them and stir up the pot cause a little bit more pain and of course when he failed and whimpered back uh he could kill him if he came back but yeah just as he was getting into his truck good to see starfire back she's uh, injecting a bit of uh, calm and reason back into the group which is nice and when raven was fighting with rose I thought maybe, like, she would, like, ring it in and just subdue her and then feel good about herself, going like, I didn't kill her, I could control it and get that confidence boost. But I didn't realize she threw her that hard and cracked all of her fucking bones. But she has a healing factor. So, so stroke of luck there. She doesn't have that on her conscience. Just the fact that she did maim her body pretty horribly with that toss. We finally see Beast Boy in uh, tiger mode again, but only very, very briefly. I think they're severely underusing his character. But hopefully that will be remedied in the next half of this season. Oh, and we still don't have any Superboy or Crypto. Where have they been this entire time? I would have figured they would have popped up by now at least. This is already, what, the fifth episode? But the little thumbnail in the corner that popped up for next week's episode had him in it, so finally, we'll finally get to see what they're all about and how they're going to fit into this entire storyline. Or will they be starting a new storyline? They could do that. Deathstroke was only the main antagonist for the first half of the season, and then it's going to like go into another story arc in the second, once they introduce Super Lad, because he has his own conflict he's running from i could see that so in the next episode they would deal with deathstroke and probably not kill him but capture him put him away but then keep rose and rose would be thankful because she doesn't have a father killing her and maybe stay with him because she saw that oh you guys were fighting for me at least half of you were not wanting me wanting to give me up for jason todd and she'll be like their uh little wolverine she has her healing factor, and she doesn't have claws, but she has her sword, which is just as deadly. What did you guys think of this episode? Do you think Jason Todd is plummeting to his death? Or if he'll just be injured and or saved? Let me know down in the comments. Hit like and subscribe if you enjoy reactions like these. Ring that notification bell so you don't miss a single one. And thanks for stopping in for this vicarious view.